Good morning, everyone. Hey, I miss you guys so much. I really do. I wish I could see you right now again. But hey, uh, again, like I said last week, we'll be back together before you know it. I hope so. But I'm glad I can share some things with you this way. I want to talk with you about wisdom. What is wisdom? Can you tell me what wisdom means? Yeah, you're right. It's, it's being smart. It's doing good things. So I want to ask you if some things I'm going to do are wise. You watch me and you decide whether it's wise or not. And then I'm going to ask you, okay? So what if I tried to talk to you right now while I run around the room all over the place, bumping into things? Whoops! Uh, watch out. Is that wise? Why not? Why would that not be wise? For one thing, I'm out of breath right now. But the other thing is, I could trip, right? And besides, you guys are probably getting seasick watching me uh, move around like that. Okay, I got something else, else to ask you if it would be wise or not. You ready for it? Give me a minute. You ready? I'm going to set this down. Tell me if this is wise. Is this wise, you guys? Would it be wise for me to talk to you upside down? To say hello this way? What if I stood all the way on my head? Is that very wise? Whew. I don't think so. I don't think it would be wise at all. In fact, I'm a little dizzy right now from standing on my head. But would it be wise? Of course not. You couldn't see me very well. I could get hurt myself doing that. Okay, I got one more to ask you. Would it be wise, while I'm talking to you, trying to teach you, if I ate on this cookie right now, and just, you know, just really enjoyed it, while I was trying to teach you some stuff, would that be wise? It's really good cookie, you want a bite? Huh, here you go. Nope, that wouldn't be wise either, right? For one thing, right now, nobody wants to share cookies. We don't want to share germs. Besides, I heard that girls have cooties. Or is it boys? Not sure. Either way, we don't want to share germs right now, right? Seriously, we want to be wise. We want to be smart. Part of the reason we're staying home right now is because it's not wise uh, for us to get together. We might get someone sick. But in the book of Proverbs, it tells us to get wisdom. It tells us to go after wisdom. And one of the places you, you guys can get wisdom is from your mom or your dad. I know a lot of your mom and dads and they're great people. And I think they're wise people. So it's really good for you right now to listen to them when you're young. Listen to their instruction. Uh, just follow after them. Also, I want to remind you that great wisdom comes from God. It comes from living like Jesus lived. Jesus loved people. He, he was kind to people. Uh, he listened to people. He cared for people. He even healed people. So if we want to be wise, we want to live like Jesus lived. We want to be extra wise right now while we're staying home a, a, a lot more. We want to take good care of each other. We want to be kind to each other. You know, if you have a Bible story book or, or a children's Bible, this would be a great time to read it and, and get some of the wisdom from God, from Jesus. If you can't read, get your mom and dad to read some of the stories to you. Uh, this is a great time just to grow in wisdom while we're at home. Let's pray right now, you guys, and ask God to make us wise. Let's pray. Dear God, uh, make us wise. Keep us from doing silly things. Uh, Lord, that would get us hurt or get us in trouble. Help us to listen to our mom and dads. And Lord, help us to listen uh, to your instruction in the Bible. Help us to learn from you. We ask all this in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, I hope you had some fun being silly with me. I'm a little ridiculous sometimes. But seriously, be wise, you guys. Listen to your mom and dad. Listen to what God says. Bye for now, and I'll see you again soon. Okay, bye now.